Hello and welcome back to Empires of the Undergrowth. So since the last episode, I've been doing a lot of work in this place and doing some missions to get more expansion for food and royal jelly. And uh, I've changed up some of the population. I've got more workers and a little bit less soldiers. Got 84 of them. We are now pretty much maxed out in every regard. There's a couple here that aren't maxed out, but... I had no idea, but if you put down these speed tiles around here, it actually counts as, like, a, a, a tile to level up. And so you can, like, actually level up the outsides by doing that, which is pretty freaking cool. So, I listened to what you guys had to say. I got a little bit more workers. Somebody said, like, 20% workers. Another person said to put speed tiles, like, pretty much everywhere. And so that's what I have done, for the most part. Uh, especially in, like, the main chamber area. I've also heard that this last challenge has some spiders and so uh, we'll be prepared for that i will move my people back to the queen eventually uh but i think we're gonna be good we got everything tier three for the most part and then we also have uh this venom thing now i, I really thought about like doing another one so i can get you know one of uh get this one weakening but i decided i'm not gonna do that uh, i don't really i don't really want to spend the time i've played a lot last night to to get prepared for this video and i don't really want to do anymore because i just want to see if we can beat this challenge and beat the game uh but yeah we're we're good to go we are ready to go i am very curious to see what's going to happen here uh if i ever do this again which i may because this game's a lot of fun i think the one thing i'm going to do is make chambers and like have like a chamber over here and a chamber over here, but not have everything together like this. The good thing about this though is that if my ants are dying, then they're gonna pop. Let's see, like a spider runs in and my ants are up here fighting or they're like dead, they're dying up here. The ants are gonna pop and be able to attack right away, which is kind of cool. The other thing is that all the nurseries are kind of together and it's really large though. So like a little spider could get in here and it would take me a while to get to it. But uh, I think. I think this is going to go quite well. So I'm curious to see how how this challenge goes. So let's go ahead and load it up. All right. Test the might of your formicarium colony. Will it survive? What did the scientists have planned? Let's go ahead and play the level. See what happens. Let's listen to these. The colony seems to have made significant progress. Let's listen to this freak. Perhaps it is time we began phase two of the trial. Agreed. I will prepare the feeder colonies. Don't let him in charge of this. Don't let him be in charge of this, okay? We're gonna fight in the. We're gonna fight in the colony. We're not gonna come outside. Let's ease them in with a familiar disturbance. Introduce twenty formica fusca ants. <laughs> the fusca colony is attached, <laughs> and the ants are on their way. As if that's gonna do anything. They better be tier threes, cause if they're not tier threes, they're gonna die instantly. Let's watch them. Let's watch them die, guys. What's the button? Isn't it control? Oh, I took it off. Never mind. I made I, I made it go away. Oh, yeah, they died quickly. Oh yeah, I took off the uh, status thing. I see they haven't lost their potency. But I don't know why I can't turn it on. Now Is let's it... try the Formica Rufa. No, it's st I don't know why I the can't Rufa see them. Will be more aggressive. Still showing some stuff. Our raptors will need to right. put up a strong defense. These are these um, adding twenty Rufa ants. These are the melee ones. It looks like. I think these are the melee ones. They could be the uh, the butt flingers. <laughs> could be the butt flingers. I don't know. No, they're the melee ones. There's no chance. There's no freaking way, dude. Look at all those. Look at all those soldiers. I've got a couple of the. Once again, the mortar. Our raptors have neutralized ants. the threat to the. But I've queen. got like tons Good. of black soldiers. Continue the experiment black ant soldiers. Before, but don't push the colony too hard. Of course not. That would be. Irresponsible. Did you review the tape from the last time? Okay. Did you review the tape? Because this dude's a psychopath. Introducing 40 Rufa ants. Bring it on. Bring it on, man. That ain't nothing. This ain't nothing. Okay, I've got 84. 84. That ought to be enough, I think. I, I can't even expand the colony anymore anyway, so... I was trying to get this ratio perfect. 84 workers to 16. That's close. It's not... Exact, but get him, get him. Excellent defense. <laughs> it's quite easy, actually. 
So far, it's easy. Let's see what this guy has. So last time he did like a sustain thing. He had increasing to fifty rufa. He had stagecoaches. He had beetles. He had combinations, combination ants. Uh, and then this time, I bet you he brings spiders. If he brings spiders, then that's gonna be something that's gonna I'm gonna have to watch because they're so fast that I'm gonna really have to watch it. But do you see how some of them come back to the queen anyway? So they all form up here, but they go back and they protect the queen too. And so, plus we have the royal guard, which we haven't even seen yet. I haven't even seen the royal guard, but apparently they're freaking OP as all get out. And so, I think uh, we haven't even lost one yet. We haven't lost a single one yet. Yeah, they like pop out. God, and good. Pop out and surround the queen. I, I haven't even, like, why do I need to go get seeds? I haven't even lost a single one yet. It You know, oh, yeah, and here's another thing, too. If I did this again, I could do this um, by, like, you know, sending out a specific group of workers. But I was thinking if I really needed to, which if I did, I think there'd be some, no, I'd have some problems. See how they handle but the Rufa and the Fusca invaders. I would think we'll start with it would be 30 of each. worthwhile to have a third group, like, of workers that the whole purpose is to go out and get food if we needed it. But I stockpile, I mean, 5,000? 5, 5,000? You think I'm going to use 5,000 seeds? 5,000 food? I don't think so. That's a ton of food, man. So, by having it here at the at the entrance, you pretty much make them into a sustained threat. And not a big, gigantic group that spreads out. A I mean, wonderful my, victory. My ants can, like, fronts. really, right, right at the gate, control them. It's like freaking Thermopylae and the Spartans over here. <laughs> Perhaps we should try three colonies this bring time. Bring it on! Bring it on! Bring Introducing it on 30 of each. All right, Rufa, so we got some... Fusca, and Raptor ants. Okay, we got some red ones. We got some little red ones. We got the... These... The black ones are the problem. The black ants are the problem. But I don't think it'll be a problem. They're... I should say they're... They're the stronger of the three, I think. But I don't think it's going to be an issue. Look at them. See, they can't even get in. They're all clustered up there. Get them, boys. The the only the only problem is is that the butt flinger A ones. Marvelous victory. I, I'm sorry I don't know the names of them, okay? But these ones that shoot out of their butts, those are the ones that should be back here. But they get up because they move around constantly like this. They sometimes get up too close and then they die. But so far they haven't died. I would... It would be good if we could. Hmm. Can we do this? I wonder how long they will survive against a sustained flow from all three colonies. Okay, can we do this right here? Let's see. What if I do this? I don't like the idea of this, but if I put another marker back, they still go up in there. There's no point. They still go up in there, man. Okay, we got a sustained threat coming in. You were doing well, uh -oh. my oh, it's Oh, yeah, the tiger beetles. I forgot about that. This? That was the other thing. A giant tiger beetle has oh, joined the Oh, a giant fray. tiger beetle. Like, that's going to do anything because he's going to get stunned by the wood ants. <laughs> we lost one. We lost one. And he... another. And another. Oh, no. Come on. Three tiger beetles. Bring it on, man. It's not going to matter. Oh, these are little baby ones, too. So the the thing with the tiger beetles is that they get stun they get stunned when they get uh, shot up they get stunned. But I think we're gonna see a spider here soon, unless it's in the next wave. Cause that was easy. The spider's gonna be the problem, especially if he brings in big spiders. Big spiders are gonna be an issue. He didn't lost one yet. Hey the. Oh, I got some food from the tiger beetle. Sweet, dude. Are you going to end this anytime? Because this is this is super easy. Oh, the other thing I was doing last night was I was doing these uh, challenges. You can do them on easy, and so they're super easy to complete. But they give you, like, tons more food. Basically, what you do is you just are completing the regular mission within a challenge mode. And the challenge is that... Crickets are burrowing into your uh, into your colony, and so you got to protect against them. They give you food; they're not hard to kill, and uh, you get a ton of uh, you get a ton of stuff. Oh, here we go! Good work, my little ants. But what? Here this? we go! One, two, three. Uh, this is the problem. Nine, ten wolf spiders. Okay, prepare it for the royal guard. Seems fair. There they are. 
The royal guard has been summoned. Oh, get them, dudes. Look at those things. They're massive. They are absolutely massive. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Look at how big they are. They're huge. The queen is in danger. Perhaps I should stop the experiment. Those things are so freaking big. Good thing I had Royal Guard because they, uh, the ants did not come back down here. Stop getting food. Fight this last spider. There we go. Jeez Louise, man. Can you fight this spider, please? Find him. There's only one left. Can you please? We've all, we've lost two, three. We've lost three ants. We, we lost more than three. You can hear them popping. But we lost... I mean, we lost a few of them. But dang! Yes, yes! Victory to the Erector! Wow, we What's wrecked... What's going on That here? challenge was so uh, easy! Yes, the, the ants performed excellently against the Rufa. They just staved off an attack from 40 Rufa ants. 40? I think that's enough for now. We don't want to overstress them. Agreed. No worries. No worries. I don't need to worry about any threat. 3,000 food? What? And the boy with the 3,000... Congratulations, your economy has grown sufficiently to complete the current early access content. The Formicarium is yours to command to control more levels. What is Continue this? Continue to watch over the Formicarium. Additional experiments will be on hold. Additional content time. is available in other game I modes understand. from the main menu. Keep no an eye on the social tests. media for news. Oh, sweet. Okay, so what is all this? Oh, this is... I'm a few eruptors can't hurt. Oh, I'm summoning them. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's the stagecoach. Wow, so that was, that was actually really cool. I'm all... Dude, I'm... Okay, we need to make more room for food. Jeez Louise, we're all maxed out on food over here. I can get 150 now? 150? Oh man, that's freaking amazing. We're about to make a massive, massive uh, base. We'll just pop the food because we need more food. Storage spaces. I've got 27 more. Maybe I'll make uh, a, another wood ant pocket. The wood ants are pretty good. I kind of want to do more soldiers, though. I don't know what to do, guys. We'll just upgrade all this. Because we're going to need... I'm going to... I'm just going to max out my coffers. Because when they eventually update the game, we're going to play this again. That's for sure. Because this game is so much fun. I, I, I heavily enjoy this game. It is... I don't really like too many RTS games. And... This is like one of the only RTS games that I've like thoroughly enjoyed. Just because it's I don't know, it's 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 a lot of fun. It's easy to pick up and learn. It's not very I mean it's challenging, but it's not like incredibly difficult or anything. It's just a lot of fun to play. And I'm a I'm a big fan of this. So, let's uh we since we got Okay, I'm going to delete some of these tiles over here. Cuz I don't need Okay, so this is one interesting thing. I wish there was a way to quickly delete. So if I was to delete one of these, you have to delete it three times because of the tiering system. And so it does they don't go away uh, all at once, which is interesting. It would be cool to get if you could like command like uh, like some spiders or something. That'd be freaking awesome. Let's get rid of that. Yeah, when this game eventually goes like Come when it's like pretty, you know, when there's a more content, I'm def so there's more content apparently in other modes. I haven't, I haven't seen that, and so I'm not entirely sure. So this is probably changing the tiering of these. I wonder. I bet yeah. Okay, so there we go. More wood ants. That'll be good to have. And we're at 113. And I'm gonna make another chamber for another group of soldiers, just to have. Okay, tier three all this. We've got plenty of food. There's seeds outside, actually. Which you could have them going and getting. That's about the only thing that I'm not used to doing is, like, the micromanaging aspect of these types of games. Pop that. <clears throat> okay, so let's, uh, let's see. What do we got? We got some seeds out here. 
We'll get some seeds over here. Have them come over here. Get some seeds over here. Yeah, and the, I don't, the other thing I don't really like about the uh, AI in this game is... Oh, you can get like a, a randomized thing. Is the fact that... Um, they're just kind of... They don't really work completely like all too well. In terms of like getting seeds and stuff. Okay, so let's... Let's make a chamber over here. I'm going to make it fairly large. And we're going to fill this with more soldiers and we're gonna make another path here should have made this ah kind of want to make this larger but I'm all out of tile spaces oh crap it would it's not gonna work if I don't fill it if I don't carve out the middle oh my gosh okay well we can always do more challenges eventually and get more uh, space but that's that's so dumb whoops well we're just gonna fill this for right now because I can manage I can afford it we get more soldiers and then we'll put some speed tiles down in here like that there we go and then that'll get get them in and out quick okay so let's bring these guys over here. Oh my gosh, we're going to have a massive, massive army. We're going to be able to like just, like withstand anything. So we've got 4,000 seeds. Oh my gosh, there's so many over here. Come over here and get... We've got tons of... we got tons of food. Never mind. Tons of food over there. All right, 130 out of 150. I'm just going to upgrade all this. Sweet. We're going to get... See, wh basically what I want to do right now is just prepare for when the game goes... When, it, when there's more content added. Because we have a pretty good colony already. And they're really... I might do it... The next video, I might do like the challenge video. Just to, sh just to show you guys what those challenges are like. Because they're pretty cool. Those spiders, man. Those things are... Good thing I have the Royal Guard, man. Good thing I have the Royal Guard. See, th and then look at this. I can pop that spot right there. And that's going to allow me to upgrade this. Nice. Yeah, so eventually what I'm going to do is I'm going to carve this whole thing out and then put speed tiles all the way around it. And then that way I can up upgrade everything in there to tier 3. That's what I should have done the f like you know the first time. So I can't really do much more until I get more space. But we can get... Let's get this 40% uh, damage from further venom attacks. And then let's also get... F retreat for 5 seconds... Uh, when out of combat, this would be nice to have. Wait, do we want to get this or cannot take more than 20 damage in a single attack? 95 chance of causing no damage. Yeah, let's just do this. That's the one, right? Yeah. And then we got one more thing. We're, we're like maxed out completely. Sweet. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the content today you enjoyed the video this game is a ton of fun i'm a huge fan of this game uh i'll play probably one more and then um unless there's something interesting in this in the other modes uh category in the main menu i don't think we'll maybe do another one uh for a while until the game updates because you know there's only so many times i think people will want to watch the same thing over and over again um so let's see where are the other modes free play custom oh we can't even alpha demo le levels oh so there's a couple modes in here maybe we can do more of these if you guys want to see more let me know thanks for watching guys i'll see you in the next one